Hey beauties, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I am going to be... If you're wondering what I am about to do right now, there is a huge trend going on YouTube right now and it's the... I tried following Blank's makeup tutorial. So that's what I'm going to do today. And I went ahead and put a poll on Facebook and asked you guys whose tutorial would you like to me like, like blah, blah, blah. whose tutorial you guys would like me to follow. So I had Patrick Star, Nikki Tutorials, um, Jordan Hans, and Mikey, also known as Glam and Glo Glam and Glore. Glam and Gore here on YouTube. And everyone wanted me to do Patrick Star. Now, if you know Patrick Star, he he's the queen of caking makeup on. Now, compared to how I do my face makeup, I'm very natural. So this is going to be fun. It's going to be, I don't know, I feel like it's going to be a challenge because he is like top notch you know in this whole youtube industry and makeup industry in general so yeah let's let's get to this video now all right he's dancing right now saying he got interested. all right guys first things first i am taking my glam glow gravity mud the silver one and it is dry because you know you want that top model skin glow. okay so i do not have that mask and the mask he pretty much did it way before filming and it's already done so i'm just gonna skip that I'm not even gonna bother doing that but i am gonna go ahead and spray for this. To a the oasis, quench the dehydrating mist. I'm obsessed with. Okay, so he's using a hydrating mist, which okay, spraying that's the face. cool because I use my Mario Badescu facial spray with aloe herbs and rose water. So he used a facial spray. Okay. <laughs> he's so extra. Oh my goodness. I think he's using the Benefit Precisely My Brow. I do not have that, so I'm going to go in and use my MAC Lingering Brow Pencil. And just fully. It's all just preference, but if you want to cheat a more straight brow, mm -hmm. Okay, so to have a straighter brow. He doesn't have to be just the top where many arguers. Otherwise, over overline the under part of the brow. Is that what he's saying? Brows, I know they look scary, but we're gonna blend a little bit later. Y'all know the drill. Um, for the face, I'm gonna take a little bit of Benefit Professional and apply this on my cheeks. I don't uh, have and yes, I'm missing a nail. So for foundation, I have my NYX pore filler here. So I'll go ahead and do that because that's kind of what pore professional does. Fills in, fills in your pores and gives a smooth filter. And he only put it here, so gonna do the same thing. Just gonna rub the excess on my forehead a bit. I'm going to take a brand new foundation. This one is called the NARS Natural Radiant Long Wear Foundation. I heard lots of good things. It's my first time trying it. Okay, this is that. the H-U-A-H-I-N-E. Joaquin. Joaquin. Okay, pause it. So I don't have that, but it's a natural radiant. Ah! 
Okay, so I don't even know if it recorded foundation because my freaking camera decided to stop recording. Okay, so I used the Makeup Forever Ultra HD foundation. I'm in the shade Y335. And I put on with a brush just like Patrick did, but it started to come out a little too streaky with the brush that I used. So I just further blended it out with my beauty blender. Okay. For Next, the under eyes, I'm going to do a concoction of concealers for the face. First, I have been loving the YSL Touche Claw. Uh, I have a little rainbow sticker so no one takes it for me and I know it's mine. And I'm in the color 5.5 and I'm just going to bump this up and simply go in on my Okay, face. I don't have that one. I love this because it's so smoothing under the okay. eyes and it's so easy and it's a pen. And you see the secret to a Patrick Star face is that we're going to draw lots of light towards the middle. So under the eyes, on the nose, and contour all around. So if you guys want attention to your face, just do that with uh, the concealer and the brightness of the concealer. Okay. Alright, now I'm going to take my beauty blender and blend. Okay, so I'm going to use my shape tape and he applies only on the center of his face. So... This area here. Alright guys, I'm going to immediately set with my one and only Patrick's Powder okay, from I have MAC that. Cosmetics. We're launching okay, internationally this month, so I am going to the Philippines if you guys didn't know. Um, I'm going at the end of the month, so if you're there, I'm gonna take see ya! So next you're going to take a bunch of powder and just beat your like face like you in the 90s, like you were 90s product. supermodel, okay, because everything... I can't. So I'm going to take the sifter off. I put too much powder on. Okay, so he used the Kristen's Dominique. Gosh, um, he's using that palette. I don't have that palette. So, what shade he used again? Oh my gosh, you guys, I am filming with the Dominique Cosmetics Latte Palette. It is gorgeous. I'm going to start off and take a little bit of caramel. Okay, caramel. so he used, yeah. he used a really light caramel shade. So, what palette am I going to use? Bump it. I'll use my Jaclyn Hills palette. So he has, I don't even know what brush he's using, but he's just putting that. I'm going to take a little bit ah! of hazelnut Wait. and mix it with mocha. Wait! Okay, so he's, he put that like transition shade, kind of. Uh, following someone else's tutorial while you're trying to film is and not easy. Definitely not easy. This is crazy. If you guys hear people arguing in the background, I'm sorry. Um, yeah, it's just, I guess, neighbors. Okay, and then he used, like, a lighter brown and then, like, a dark chocolate. So I'm going to use this one. So I first used this one because it looked like the caramel shade. Um, and then I'm going to use 
this one and this one because that's kind of look it looks like the two shades that he used and then gosh put in his and apply crease. this on the inner and outer crease and the brush that I'm using is the Morphe M433. This is a must-have brush. If you guys want to cop it brush. using the P-Star discount code, snatch it. All right. Come on, blends. Come on, hooded eyes. I am applying it on the inner and outer third. And I'm just connecting it in the middle to create this halo eye effect. And the reason why I did this eye, you guys, is because I'm inspired by Tyra and, like, her like halo eyes she seems to favor like a spotlight I, like I, eye. I would love to do her makeup one day for my channel it'd be so fun guys now for the center of the lid this hey. is <laughs> oh my god so magical i'm gonna take my lit cosmetics one of my favorite brands okay. ever. It's an oldie but a goodie. Uh, this is the best liquid glitter base ever. It's unique because it's liquid. And I'm going to mix it with the Lit Addicted plus Silver. I'm just going to go ahead and apply this to the center. Okay, is that like a silver shade? My lid. Do you see that? Okay. So it is a silver pretty. shade. I don't have that. So... We gotta see what we can work with. Is that like a glitter glitter or is it like a pigment? Kinda looks like a pigment. It doesn't even look like a glitter. Okay, you guys. Huh? Hate when this happens. Okay, let me see. What do I have? <laughs> Okay, his look a lot blended, so I'm going to, and it's a lot spread it, it's like, like spread it out a little more, so that's what we're going to do. I'm going to spread it out a little more, and then we're going to also blend. The... Okay, that's what I'm going to do for now. And then I see that he's putting liquid liner on. But let me kind of close this stuff up before um, you know we go on. Um, and I'm going to use my Essence Eyeliner Pen. It's the waterproof one. I'm going to try to be in frame for this. If not, I'll just cut it out. Instead of black, the brown oh, just adds wait. some sort of softness and He's using a elegance. brown. Oh, and here's he a tip too. Okay. If you guys do glitter okay. on the oh, eye, see, it's best to use a liquid liner because if you use a gel, let's say like Inglot or Black Track oh. or something, the gel will crumble on top of the adhesive oh. and your primer and it'll just crumble up and that's okay. not what you want so i advise if you're using a liner liquid is best now for the bottom of the waterline i'm going to go ahead and take this beautiful mac pencil it's such a pretty color Ugh, so creamy and this is an eye coal eye coals by mac are so so soft it's in the color called costa rich and I'm same, going to cut line my waterline. And I'm going to take the newest Bad Gal Bang Mascara by Benefit and apply many coats on my lashes. Can I just say, I feel so much better double stacking my lashes. Wait, did he smoke something out? Something was off. Okay. He's doing too much. Okay. He smoked out. And I need to get my charger before my laptop dies. So I use that as my monitor. Okay, let me go and get um, my charger. I'll be right back, you guys. Well, as soon as I'm I gonna smoked take it, my off. Maybelline so I took just the some colossal big shot. That I am stacking Wait. for a more full. And he's doing lashes. Okay, let me coat my bottom lashes. And he put a lot of coats. But 
I don't think I need to do that. And then he has the lashes, but they're like wispy, full. Okay, I'm gonna use my house house of lashes, Natalia. Do I have my lash clip? Okay. I'm gonna use those and put those on always. Okay, I need to clean them. So unsanitary. Because they stalled in to look a little not worn out, but I just need to clean them. That's all. I put mascara and stuff on it. Okay, so while I'm gonna do this, what he took a little bit of my shadow from my collection okay. and bark and just put this on the outer okay. lash line. Okay, and then he puts a darker um Where my tweezers cause I need my tweezers. Can't you got a stick? I hate putting lashes on. I'm just gonna place these right there. Okay. I feel like lashes always. All right, guys. I finally got the whole lash thing situated. Okay, so he used Embark, which I do not have on the outer part of the lash line. So I'm just gonna use a very dark brown. And the Jaclyn Hill palette. Wait. Wait, okay. I need a big. Let me just take out my brushes. Here. Okay, so he took a powder brush and dust off the uh, fallout, which is kind of like everywhere on my face. Alright, you guys, this is crazy. And then he used brush, love this brush. a foundation powder. I'm going to go in. Ooh, it looking cute. With my Guys, I'm looking so snappy tonight. Girl. Now for the under eye, I'm going to take the Makeup Forever Pro Finish again in a lighter color in the 128 brush. And this, I think, want to oh. say is my oldest okay. brush. So pretty much he used foundation powders to highlight and bronze. So I'm just going to go in and use my... Loving this one. Let me use. Yeah, I'm gonna use my Elf bronzer palette. And I'm gonna use my Morphe M110 brush. I'm gonna use contour shade here, the darkest one in the palette, and then just. Go ahead and put some color, color back into the face. Okay, I don't think this brush is good enough. Anymore. All right, we're gonna switch brushes. I'm gonna use my M527 brush from Morphe. The way he did it, it was just like he put it all over his face. Like, so I don't know if that's him contouring. Oh, but 
that's what we're going to do. My gosh, my forehead is so patchy. It's like if it's blush too. That was too much. Okay, 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 okay. I think that's enough. And then he used a lighter powder, a lighter powder. He's using that. Okay, so I'm going to take my Morphe M528, and I'm going to take the light shade here and the yellow banana powder from Anastasia, and we're going to put that. a beauty blender and then took the and if powder and spritz after all the powder is set and done because this looks beautiful on any skin type. You just have to work with your skin type. Alright, okay. I'm gonna take uh, this color this dark right here. to mineralize skin finish. I love this powder. And I'm a whole heat. Oh, uh, okay, so he didn't contour, he just put like a foundation powder over to kind of set and bring color. Okay, so I messed up on that part. Okay, so he has a blush, and I'm going to use my um, Essence Mosaic Blush. This one here. Um, I'm going to use this Morphe Angle Brush. Okay, wait, wait. <laughs> hey, I'm still in blush. Packing the song because he put a lot. <sighs> oh, this is looking dry. I'm about to drench in some powder. Okay, so I need to put my brush somewhere. lip injection lip look and I tried to emulate it with just three products this is mm -hmm. cork lip liner by, by MAC which I don't have shy girl lipstick it's the most beautiful which peachy I don't have. Okay. lip ever and then I have bow okay which lip I don't have either so all MAC products pretty. Um, all and MAC products the secret about products. this lip combo so is like a dark brown lip liner, the liner do you see how beautiful a peachy pink is? lipstick uh, and then a gloss to be put on top okay lip liners what do we got for lip liners? Okay, let's use brown sugar from Jonay Blue. Um, yeah, use this. Okay. And he over. You know what? He didn't even show himself contouring his nose, and I see his nose is smashed. So. I'm gonna do that. Okay, I have one from e.l.f. It's called Coral Cutie. Okay, so. Guess. Okay, let's replay this. Guys, look how beautiful this lip is. This lip would not be complete without this. Okay. That's. Mine's look a lot more pink. So I'm going to go in with, I know I got a gloss, put that on top because it will, it's a little more nudie, kind of mute down that pinky shape, and I need another dark liner, maybe this one will work because the one that I use is not cute.
Okay, so that was the end of the video with him putting the wig on. I'm just going to set my face because... I'm looking dehydrated. <laughs> okay, so this is the final look here. That was harder than I thought. My goodness, like, I think the hardest part for me wasn't following his tutorial. I think it was, like, trying to follow him and film this at the same time because my camera sets, it only pretty much films, like, it'll record for 12 minutes and that's it. So it's like I had to keep making sure that... I was following and also making sure I was recording at the same time. So I know there are parts where I was doing something or in the middle of something and I wasn't recording. So I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, but dang, this is full coverage, you guys. Like, and this is cool. Like, but it's not heavy. I don't feel like tight or anything in the face like I don't know tell me what you guys think only thing is he didn't put any highlighter on he didn't put any highlighter on so yeah I would like to highlight <laughs> I would definitely like to highlight but this was so much fun this was so 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 much fun I definitely want to do another one for you guys um but again like I said something more in the line of special effects or painting you guys let me know who you would like to see and I will go ahead and do that for you guys. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give this video a thumbs up. And not only that, but make sure you go ahead and subscribe to my channel. And you guys will get to see more fun videos like this. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Mwah!